There is a question. In I'm saying since 30 percent of students repeat statistics scores in a sample of 100 students, what is the probability they at less than 35 percent, greater than 37 percent, greater than 15 percent and in between 20 and 27 percent students would repeat the course. सबसे पहले काम क्या करना है कि इसको मैथमेटिकल फॉर्म में कन्वर्ट कर लें प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट पी हेड विल बी लेस देन 35% 35% 0.35 uh, सॉरी लेस देन 35% दिस इज द मैक्सिमम लिमिट द मिनिमम लिमिट विल बी माइनस इंफिनिटी ग्रेटर देन 37% head is greater than 37 percent 37 percent to graph once divide kar le to 0.37 and it will be plus infinity greater than 15 percent p head will be greater 15 percent mean 0.15 how much greater plus infinity and between 27 and 20 percent, 20 percent and 27 percent. So we need these probabilities. So again, you need, you need to use the standard form is g is equal to p hat minus mu p hat divided by sigma p hat. By property, you know that mu p hat is equal to p. This is given in the question, this is 30 percent. And sigma p hat, this is equal to p into q divided by n under root. If p is equal to 30 percent, so q is definitely 70 percent. The reason is q is equal to 1 minus p, so 1 minus 0.3 is 0.7 n is equal to 100 and under root. If you calculate it, you get sigma p hat and this is equal to 0 0.045. So, z becomes p hat minus uh, 0.3 and divided by 0 0.045. So, the first part is probability that p hat is less than 35 percent. Yehi ta? So, we have to standardize it. Check kar lehen ki kya waqi less than 35 percent, yes. So, if we standardize kar lehen, to this is equal to probability that z is n between p hat minus infinity is the minimum limit minus 0.3 divided by 0 0.045. Maximum limit is 0 0.35 minus 0 0.3 divided by 0 0.04. This is equal to minus infinity and this is equal to 0 0.05 divided by 0 0.045 and this is equal to probability that minus infinity is less than g is less than 1.12. If you sketch the diagram, you need the area between 1.12 and minus infinity. So, you need this area plus this area it is greater than half. So, if you add these two areas, 
mathematically the area between minus infinity and 0 plus the area between Zero and one point one two. This is point five plus one point one. If you have two, can you see? One point one zero one two point three six eight six point three six eight six. Or this is equal to point eight six eight six. Or this is equal to it is 6.86 percent probability. So, it means that in these 100 students, out of these 100 students, the probability that less than 35 percent will repeat statistic subject, its probability is how much? 86 percent. Okay, turn to the second part. Second part, it is greater than 0.37. So, again we will use the same uh, equation, we need the probability that p hat is greater than 0.37, how much greater it is not given, so this is equal to probability that standardize it, you know that the minimum limit is 0 0.37 and minus this is 0 0.30 and this is this is how much this is only been calculated 0 0.045 so this is 0 0.045 and this is plus infinity minus 0 0.30 and divide by 0 0.045 so this is equal to probability that 0 0.07 divided by 0 0.045 as less than z is less than plus infinity. So if you calculate it, you get 1.55 is less than z is less than plus infinity. And if you switch the diagram, you need the area between. 0 plus side minus side and 1.55 is positive value so you need 1.55 to plus infinity you need this area so the method is choose this entire area 0 to plus infinity z is from 0 to plus infinity and subtract the area between 0, z is from 0 to 1.55. So, you know this is equal to probability point, sorry, this, is, this area is 0.5 minus, if you search 1.5 below 1 1.5 below 1.5 0 1 2 3 4 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 0 1 2 uh, as an assignment for you guys and practice on it and submit it on Google Classroom. Thank you. Thanks for watching.